Do I need to go this way? This is not a death, I'm not counting it. I already died once as young Nathan. This is an arrest, technically! <laughs> locked. Hmm, it's locked. Blocked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. Blocked. I like how this, like, game lets me do before. And I will say, I, when I checked, when I paused earlier and I was checking to see, like, yo, how far in the recording are we? Should I stop now? But I decided I was gonna do this uh, segment, and then I'll stop after. But even the gate's kind of like you got, you gotta go. The air vent up there. Oh yeah, that could get us into the room below. Yeah, I wonder how I'm gonna climb up there. You what? I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can I handle it? All right. Let's see what you got then. Are you ready? I like I just triggered for them to move it without me like doing whatever I need to. Oops. It's a Polaroid. Oh boy. Oh, let me see. I think it still works. Yeah. Come here. Now smile, all right? <laughs> Don't lose it. Don't worry, I won't. Oh no! I didn't shake it. Oh no, my hat. Okay, up here. Oops, that's a great photo. We saw it at the beginning of the game. Just look again if you if you miss it. I wonder how they place these up. Oh no! There. Like, does, I guess someone gets a ladder and does it. Oh my god, was his leg super long? God, I was not paying attention. Oh my god, smoke detector! Oh my god! Don't smoke up here, Nathan. His arm didn't look right there either. Oh, this was the dead end. Aha, uh -huh, now we turn left. Can you imagine if we go through this and that's like, Badoosh, you're actually um, back in that garden room. That nice green room. Oh my god, I wish I could have green. Green room? Uh, it's not a greenhouse. Oh god, what are those rooms called? They have the light coming in. Oh, either way, I want it. Okay, I'm in. <sighs> Codeine. Lots of painkillers. It's locked from this side too. And look around. Is there a key nearby? No, but there's a fucking like uh, medical setup. Evelyn, I was hoping I wouldn't have to write this letter. I was hoping our last conversation made my intentions clear. I was hoping that ignoring your repeated attempts to contact me would eventually send the right message. Discovering you sent my daughter a check in the mail means the message was way too subtle for someone like you. I don't need your money, and more to the point, I don't want your money. I could take care of my family just fine without your help. It's insulting to both of our intelligences to pretend that your hollow jester would somehow rekindle our relationship. What little was left of our bond died the moment you couldn't bother to show up for dad's funeral. Right up to the moment he drew his last breath, he, was, he still loved you. I don't. I pray you find peace with whatever you've been seeking your entire life, but do not contact me or my family again, Edmund. Well, that's sad. Doesn't even call her mom. But I mean, that's kind of what you get for distancing yourself from your kid your whole life. You can't just all of a sudden, Got like, it. get money and, like, send money to them in hopes that it's going to repair the relationship. You sh I get it. You know, people grieve in their own, sweat, own ways and stuff like that. But you obviously were emotionally distant from um, your son his whole life. And the fact that, like, you couldn't even show up to Anything? Ken's funeral. Didn't see any journals. Alright, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. If that door is locked for the outside and the inside, and the key was on the inside, though. Maybe there's two keys. Maybe that's what's implying. There's two keys. 
Is like, how the hell does like uh, she on. leave? You know. Well, let's see what we find. How she get back into the room? Or maybe it's just been locked for her this whole time. I found a Sam. Nope. No. University of Toronto. A lot of stuff here. <gasps> Cassandra Morgan! Cassandra Morgan! Cassandra Morgan. Sam. You got something? <gasps> this is it. <laughs> CM. Why is that white leather so popular with the archaeologist? Joseph Paris. Evelyn bought a first edition of a general history of pirates from a collector along with the... Oh, I can just hit X to read. What am I doing? Evelyn bought a first edition of a general history of the pirates from a collector, along with a stack of 18th century documents. Among them, I found a very intriguing letter from one Joseph Burns, who not only admits to being a crewman on Henry Avery's ship, but possibly hints at Avery's vast treasure. What else would, could Riches of Paradise refer to? If he sent this letter from prison, he clearly didn't have the treasure with him. So where is it? I need to trace it back to the source. Henry Avery's attack on the gunsway. Picture caption Joseph Burns. Map caption. Last note sighting. Note above letter. What are these markings? Whoa. Henry Avery. Gunsway heist. Hey! No, no, I wasn't done! Oh, jeez. Well, you explains why Sam is so adamant that the that treasure belongs to them. Me. It's because yeah, it was the last thing either. their mom had researched. Yeah, no, that's definitely mom's handwriting. Up your hands. She's been Seven in the room eight. the whole time. Hey, no, <laughs> she hasn't been. That. What is he holding? Hey, hey, you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now. We wait for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really dun, dun, don't dun. want to you. Come on, lady, it was no harm, no foul, all right? We wait, it's a butterfly effect thing. If I bring up the fact that I've seen her letters... <laughs> your son, Edmund, I know about him! And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, the, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's voice. Yep. Uh, <gasps> hi. My God! <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah, yes, you still might. So, uh, do you mind? Old-fashioned lighter, pretty cool. You knew her mom. She worked for me, as I'm sure you've noticed. I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. I wonder how their mom died. I wonder if it says it so online somewhere. 
But then her illness is... No oh, illness, well... Just wait for them to say it! It's alright. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries... This would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. So Francis Drake. Francis model. Drake! Yeah! Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Yeah. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Oh. Yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out. Hmm? Yeah. Uh. Here. <sighs> Sorry about the mess. <laughs> Come on, Nathan. Let's go. Uh oh. I like her says old woman. Her name is Evelyn. Holy shit. Hey. 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 Stan? Ma'am? Oh, Khalid. You all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. Can't just leave her here. It's nothing we can do for her. All right, we have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Okay, so while that whole scene was playing, I was looking up uh, anything else about their mother that might be out there that I just don't know from the games. And um, according to the uh, Uncharted uh, fandom wiki, Cassandra Morgan died under uncertain circumstances, said to be suicide, a possible result of an ambiguous illness. Oh, I couldn't have- God, I need to pay more attention. Oops! That's one way out of here! Oh, he climbed up. See, I thought he climbed down, so I'm stupid. Killed young Nathan. But anyways... I was- Oh god! Should have waited for Sam to move. I, I would. When when was it ever? There's no reference point to the the suicide bulletin on that. And I, I mean, right? Uh, can I not climb up? Please, thank you. I mean, Evelyn referenced just jump an illness, which one could also be using to describe like depression or another reason one might commit suicide. You know. Like a mental illness of some sort. But, um. I don't know. I took it as, like, cancer. Or, like, you know. You know. Unknown illness that, you know, is terminal. Which, in my mind, I always just assume it's a cancer okay. of some sort. You don't even need to be specific what type of cancer. Run, Forrest, run! Anyways, I'm back into it, paying attention, and you run from the cops. One adult! Oh yeah, he is one, an adult, yeah, because he aged out of the orphanage. Sorry. Go, 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 go! I'm just following you! I'm gonna have you lead the way. Go 
for backup. We're two kids. Well, I mean, I mean I'm a kid. But like... Jesus Christ, don't hit him! Uh, 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 what? I'm stuck on a bush! I'm stuck on a bush! Can I climb this? Climb up! I'm about to get arrested! This is not the direction to run, I guess. Back up the stairs. Can I climb up that? No. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Do I need to climb up this? Do I need to go this way? You are in big trouble, kid. This is not a death. I'm not counting it. I already died once as young Nathan. This is an arrest, technically. So that just... Uh, did I try to arrest one in post? I don't know. That's where I needed to go! <laughs> my gosh. Oh my lord. This is why I just need to follow Sam in this sequence. Instead of, uh... I literally was like five seconds from ending this sequence and I decide to like, run away from Samuel. My controller is buzzing like all hell. I'd say we're clear, but we catch our breath for a second. I, oh, also I will say, when I was looking up their mother, it did confirm that their father not didn't die, he just surrendered um, them to the state, basically. What, what did it say? Uh, Some night, huh? Oh, Sam was kicked out of the Wait. orphanage, apparently. He, he didn't age out, he got kicked out. I, will wait. I assume he hey. still aged out. And you listen to me. Yeah, Cassandra's husband there. surrendered their sons to the that state and sold she... all of the possessions. Boom, bada bing. Um, sick. She was. Oh, she definitely. I mean, it's okay to feel bad. There she was definitely was sick. Not in the like, dude, that's a sick old lady. We're like, she's twisted and stuff. No, like, literally, she was very sick. You saw her bedroom, Nathan. I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. And we don't. What do you I'm mean serious. we don't? We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined to for something great. Until tonight, I didn't know what that meant. But this, Mom's unfinished work, this is our chance to restart our lives with brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. You know some guys? Now, as for our new name, Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? And it's us! You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise, you and me together, we're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? Aha! Uh -huh. He said the title! He said the thing! <laughs> it's like... Change that. It's like when a movie says its title inside of it, and you're like, that's a little forced! I mean, this isn't literally, like, too forced. Okay, just hold still. I love you, Elena! For a while it felt like... If we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. After I lost him, I, or after I thought I lost him, 
You didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. Well, that's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. True. But it's a lot. Love to know what you're thinking. What's well, Elena thinking, not thinking you're about? I found you when I did. Yes, I am. The first time and this time. I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. It would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> no, I mean, how did you get here? Oh, of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive, par for the course. Now we just need to rescue the other Drake. What do you mean? I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. Yeah, I wouldn't miss it. So what happened to Sam? Three pass Grace him. Got him. Shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah, they're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar? No, there is no Alcazar. It's all bullshit. Wait, Dude! The dip, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything. Dude, if he had told Elena from the beginning, hey, we need to go on this adventure. We need to go rescue my brother. Because Hector Alcazar has, like, you know, like, he owes Hector Alcazar money. Blah, 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 blah. Elena would like, Hector Alcazar died six months ago, Nathan. I'm a journalist. I know this stuff, you know, like. And then Nate would have, like, turned around at Sam. Because, of course, this would be, like, he invited Sam over for dinner. And Sam would be like, uh-oh. Uh, well, you see, but I'm I didn't want to tell you. Don't, no, don't say that on the ladle. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. That's my woman. We're headed to the northern side of the island. Yeah, New Devon. For better or worse. And that's where Wraith is taking your brother. The treasure's probably there. Just need to save okay. Sam before they find it. This is where I'm going to sign off for now. It's been a great time playing with you all. Probably the next time I record this, uh, we are going to complete the game. So we're real close to the ending right now. If you obviously can't tell by us getting close to the treasure finally. And Rafe having Sam again and that whole uh, thing revealed. I know I already said it before, but uh, let me know if you have any thoughts on like that whole... Sp no, not sp I suppose I call it a whole spoiler thing, but it's not a spoiler. That whole um, bombshell, that whole twist in the story. Did you already know it was coming? Or not because you played this before, but because you saw the signs leading. Like there are pre previous, um, there's the previous scene with Nadine and Rafe talking in the uh, Scotland, uh, minis not ministry, but the church area where you're listening in on their conversation. And Nadine is like, uh, don't trust the Drake or blah 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 blah. Something they mentioned, like like they just say like a Drake brother or so. You know, like they say Drake, but they don't say Nathan or Sam. They were talking about Sam, but Sam immediately after that conversation was like, "Damn, they're like so worried about seeing you, Nathan," because Sam doesn't want Nathan to even think for a second that they somehow know that like about Sam and they like they trusted Sam at one point, stuff like that. Or, like, obviously the fight right with against Nadine right before the whole um, bombshell drops, you know. Nadine's like, I'm not trusting that. It's a Drake again. You really think I'm going to fall for that again? Because she already trusted one for two years. Or however long she was in with Rafe and, like, breaking him out of prison. Stuff like that, you know. I wonder if he broke Sam out and then he hired Nadine later. I wonder how the order of events of that went. But, either way. God, just look at my lovely wife. Hello, Elaine. Um, 
Elena, not Elaine, Elena. Either way, I hope you guys uh, have a good rest of your day, whenever you're watching this. Good rest of your night, morning, whatever. And um, remember to like, comment, subscribe. I don't know. I, I remember last time I said, oh, check out my Instagram. I'll try to remember to post more. I haven't posted more. I'm not going to lie, Chief. I haven't posted more. Maybe I will by the time this part of the recording goes out. Somehow I doubt it. Either way, I will catch you guys all in the next one. Peace.